Hey everybody, my name is Dan Demogorgas, and welcome to Jet Force Gemini. It's a Nintendo 64 game from 1999, so it's a, it's a classic. It's a, it's a really cool game. It's, um, it's one of the few games from Rare before they got bought by Microsoft. and It's, it's one of my favorite uh, Nintendo 64 games. Okay, what are we gonna name it? Um, all right, so this game is kind of weird. It's a little, you know, it's old. I mean, it's old school. But it's like a shooter, like a third-person shooter. The controls are kind of weird. I'll admit that much. They're not bad. They're just kind of weird. But play as like these two twins and they uh they have a dog I think it's, that's Juno and then um what is that like in uh Vegas I don't know what her name is but that's Lupus I think oh her name is Vera that's what it was I think Juno and Vera and Lupus I don't know we'll find out soon but I guess they're on the hunt for criminals or something. I don't really know. I like the fuzzy dice. <laughs> it's a nice touch. Okay, so those are the tribals. They're uh, they're getting enslaved and killed by the the ant people, I guess. These, these ant drones. These are alien species. I don't know. It's just it, just go go with it. <laughs> Um, yeah. And now we're getting... ...abducted? Or we're gonna, we're gonna dock them. Oh, they docked us. Oh, shit. Okay. Wow. Okay. Hello. Welcome, Juno. We've been expecting you. V Vela. Okay, her name's Vela. That's what it was. Vela and Lupus came charging soon. Not too long ago. Feisty pair, aren't they? A Magnus. Goldwood Ambassador. <laughs> this freaking voice. I don't know if I can do that all the time. <laughs> that, that the Union's <laughs> cheers without backup. The tribals couldn't hope to fend off Mizal's raiders. You'll find the tribal king in his hunt just this way. I promise to send you to him when you arrived. Follow the green door symbols to move forward. Or the red ones if you want to retrace your steps. But, you've, but I've rambled on long enough. You better hurry if you're hoping to catch up with your dirty rights. Oh god. The controls are inverted. Which I think I might be able to change, but I don't... I don't really care. If that's how the game is intended, I'd rather stick with it. So this is the hut. I think the tribal's in. The tribal king. Yeah, that's the boy. That's our boy. Let's see. Let's see. Uh, his voice is the same. Okay, well, uh, I'll try to make it different. Juno, thank you for coming! A dark day is upon us when King Jeff of the Tribals is powerless to save his own people. We can only trust to Jet Force Gemini to th thwart Mizar's plans for domination. The R's look like A's. Or do the A's look like R's? Tell you what, it's getting a bit depressing, all this king business. Still, you keep a stiff upper lip. If you could rescue as many Tribals as possible in between slaughtering drones, I'd be most grateful. Let me know if you see my brother too. He's been missing for some time. I hope to return these favors later, but at the moment I can do little. Except perhaps conjure up a time loop to replay the invasion. Show me the invasion. Show me your tortured past. So basically what happened is the drones invaded the tribals and like I guess try to enslave them. 
it's just like a dominant thing. They're just like, we gonna take over, invade. We're not too sure of the intention besides, I guess, like taking planets. I mean, just... like, comment, subscribe if you cry every time. Like, dead. Like, this is dark. I don't like it. <laughs> I don't like it. And the baby crying. Yeah. If you cry every time. Leave a comment down below. So that's kind of the reason we're killing these ants, I guess. That's our mission. <laughs> Don't be too hasty, Juno. Good Lord, is it the place it once was? You can't risk going un unprepared. Keep an eye on your pistol's charge gauge, as you'll need all the firepower you can muster. Oh my god. For a start, life force doors such as the one you will open while there's our troops active in the area. You must destroy all nearby enemies to progress. Landing use of the I button for manual targeting. Or R button. <laughs> also take note of these region markers. A great one lets you know that you're about to enter a new region. A red one shows that you're leaving a region. And both together mean that you're moving from one region directly into another. That's about all I can tell you. Get through this foster and you'll be ready. As you'll never be. Good luck, Juno. Listen to the griefer before you start and be careful. Oh, the briefing. So, are we gonna just... We just gonna... We gonna kill? Oh yeah, don't shoot him or he'll freak out. He doesn't like that. Alright. Forest world. Oh. This one's peaceful planet from Mizar and his evil Oh yeah. This music is A1. I love the music in this game. Gems can be collected. These will increase your health. Okay, so the gems are health. Blue being the smallest, and then purples, I guess the medium. Red's that good, good. They remain on Goldwood in great numbers. Yes, we gotta kill these drones. Don't be caught off guard by sniper drones. They use the treetops as ambush points. Pick them off using manual targeting. Sniper, no sniping. These crates contain ammunition. Collect them to increase your supplies. Okay. You gotta save him. Oh yeah, Mizar is like the the boss of the drones. Like he's this he's the big bug in charge. Okay, that's a good briefing. Well. I think this is a good place to leave it off, actually, because, uh, we're gonna be dealing with a lot of crazy stuff, but, uh, thank you all so very much for watching. Please like, comment, and subscribe. Uh, let me know what you think about the new series of Jet Force Gemini. It's an old school game, so it's I'm testing it out, but I really like the game, but, uh, the playful philosopher quote of the day is, for cultural invasion to succeed. It is essential that those invaded become convinced of their intrinsic inferiority. Paulo Fieri? 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 Not sure how you pronounce it, but I think that was an appropriate uh, quote because, I mean, this is all about being invaded, and because you're the weaker culture or whatever, they're gonna dominate, and it's. Uh, you can apply that to real life stuff, you know? If you have greater numbers and more of a military mindset, you'll tend to dominate other people in general. But, uh, I will see you all in the next video.
Later.